Hello and welcome to this video tutorial on using Mahara ePortfolios. In this video we're going to be looking at how to add an image to your portfolio. Okay, so I'm on my portfolio here. I'm on the dashboard at the moment. And uh, to add an image, I'm going to go to one of my pages. So I click on Portfolio in the top menu. And then in the sub-menu, we need to be on Pages, which is the first option. Okay. Now I want to add an image to my Film Studies page. So here it is. Just click on the page itself. And here we are. Now as usual, we need to edit the page. So we go to Edit this page in the top right-hand corner. Okay. Now here we, we're given various menu options in the middle. And the one I'd like it to select this time is files images and video so click on that one it's the second option and here again we've got various options the one I want now is add an image okay so as per usual in Mahara all you need to do is drag and drop the block into your page okay so I want to put the image uh, I'm gonna put it here in the middle so just drag and drop it in and uh, we'll be given a pop-up screen um, with various options so first of all, we've got to add a title. So here at the top, um, I'm going to give it a, a more descriptive title, obviously, than an image. So let's call it um, Practical Film uh, Screenshot, as this image is going to be a screenshot from one of our films. Um, OK, so that will, that will do. OK, so we've got a title. And here, we want to be on My Files here in, in the various um, options that you're given, just choose my files, which is the, the default one and, and the first one. Um, and again, as usual, we need to check on this box here. We need to just check this box to confirm that everything we're uploading, um, all the content is copyright free or doesn't break any copyright laws. If you don't check that box, you cannot proceed. It won't let you upload anything. So if I just check that and then I just need to click on choose file. OK, so then from your computer, you need to find the image that you want. Uh, I've got it here. It's called Blind Love Screenshot. So I click on that and open it. And you'll see that it's been added. Now, it's been added to the home section here, which has all your files. And actually, it's been added here as well to the actual um, files for this page. OK, so it needs to be here at the top in order to be on the page. If it's not here, all you need to do is click on select here at the bottom and then it will also appear here at the top. Okay, so that's fine. So I've got a name. I've got the image I want. I'm happy with that. Now, we also need to think about image size. Okay, now this image I've uploaded is quite small, which is good. Now, before you do any of this, in fact, you really should check that the image you're uploading is not too big because we have a limit, a storage limit on Mahara. And if you keep adding files which are very, very big and heavy, they will use up all your, your storage capacity, okay? So it's a really good idea to check the size of your image before you upload it onto Mahara, okay? So before this stage. Um, you don't need an image, you won't need any images really that are over 800 pixels wide. Um, so, you know, do check your images before you upload them. Now, I've already uploaded it, this image is quite small anyway, so it's okay. And I can also change the size just here at the bottom. So I'm going to go for 400 pixels as a width here. Um, I'm happy with that, so it's not too wide. And once you've chosen the width, you can basically just save here at the bottom, and we should see our picture displayed on the page. Okay, there it is. So I've got my picture there, I'm quite happy with that. Um, it looks pretty good, the size is okay. Um, if you need to change the size or change the title or anything else, just click on this configuration little icon here in the top right corner of the image. And again, you can make the changes that you want. You can change the title, change the size of the picture, change the actual picture, of course, and, and, and so on. OK, so I'm going to save that again. And that's it. OK, so that's how to add an image. Uh, so once again, do remember to check the size of the image before you upload it onto Mahara. Um, otherwise, you will reach your limit quite quickly. Okay, thanks very much.